Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Christian and welcome back to another RF Online Play Park video. So we are now in the Neo Nexus Speed Server. It's been up for around two weeks and I'm here to give you a beginner's tutorial. So this is good for all of you who just downloaded the game and don't know what to do. Or if you're an old player like me, just want to do a refresher on how to play the game. This is the video for you. So let me just enter my password, FireGuard password, and let's go to a vacant slot in my account. And let's create a new character. So there's three races in Korra, I mean in RF Online, Bilato, Korra, and Akrisha. We'll focus on the Korra Alliance, which is my favorite of all the three races. And like the title suggests, I'm gonna do a short guide on a warrior. So there are rangers, mystics, and specialists, but we'll focus on the warrior because they're very good for beginners and they're very strong in the end game when you're high level. So you have an option to change your gender, <laughs> I mean choose your gender in the beginning. Um, and you can choose the looks, the hair, the face, the clothes, which doesn't matter eventually because it gets covered with your armor when you're playing the game already so just choose any look you want put a name there and let's dive right into the game so character has been created successfully um enter and one funny thing is that there's actually a beginner tutorial like this before you enter the game which I never really did in my entire lifetime playing the game so if you have time do this tutorial but if you're like me who just want to play the game and skip these things let's press escape dive right into the game so let's quit the tutorial so if you have time do that tutorial so anyway as soon as the game loads, we are now in the Korra HQ. And uh, the first thing you should do is like zoom out. So use the mouse scroll button so you can zoom out. And skip or press X these initial greetings. Um, you can read them if you want, but um, I, I won't do that because it's going to take a long time. And initially, you will get rewards. So a, a sword, bow, and a staff. And basically, all of the weapons you need until you reach level 45. So that's nice. Um, next up, what you should do is press H on your keyboard, which, goes, uh, which makes your character go to keyboard mode. So that you can move around the map with W, A, S, and D. And there use Q and E to uh, pan pan left pan right or look around but I like to um, hold the right click so I can just click it there and look around um, next up you uh, press I on your inventory you got free red potions for health blue potions for mana and yellow potions for stamina and there's actually a an auto potion system in RF online so just press Y on your keyboard it opens your macro C auto potion just put your red potions in there so that the game automatically heals you and uses your potions so put your blue potions here FP yellow potions here and there Next, press L on your keyboard. It opens up your skills. So I'm a warrior. I'm in the close range skills. So let's get one of the skills here. Slash. And buffs. Wild Rage, Accuracy, Reach. The three basic buffs of warriors. Press Y again. And I like to use the auto action so I can put the buffs here. Like so. So buff up your character. This increases your attack. The other buffs like increases your accuracy <laughs> from the name accuracy. And oop, let's increase this. So accuracy and reach. 
Okay, so some basic buffs. And next up, what you should do is press J on your keyboard. It open it opens up your journal. And the first page, these are your main quests. These are actually what will guide you up until maybe level 45. So I get a lot of comments in the YouTube channel asking, where do I level up? And this is basically what you should do. Just follow your journal until around level 45. Do all of the quests there and eventually you'll reach level 45. So by the time you're that level, you'll, you'll get the hang of the game already. So anyway, click on this box. And now the quest goes here in your lower right screen. Press it again. And... The map opens. Oh yeah, the hotkey for map is M. So press M, and there's a green icon on the map. And all you have to do is follow them. So these are the monsters you have to kill. Um, get your sword, and press this thing here, peace or combat mode. And start whacking away these monsters. So pressing space bar is the basic attack. but you can use hotkey, which is, um, I forgot if this is backslash or forward slash, but the one button beside enter, it switches from number keys or function keys. I like to use number keys 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 because it's near to WASD. So I put slash there uh, and it uses slash. And I'm level 3 already because this is a speed server and there's a lot of XP multiplier here. Okay, and okay, there's we can use a bow. Just put your ammo here. Um, initially, you can use a bow and a staff and you can use the basic skills. But eventually, because you're a warrior, you're gonna have to focus on warrior skills so eventually you'll unlock expert and elite spells which are cool so let's just do the quest hunt flim and I, I guess we should use a bow so we can finish the quest faster all right so as soon as you do the quest it's green already so okay let's just continue whacking away these monsters oh yeah and press X to loot See, oh, and it loots. So the loots, you sell them to the NPC in the HQ, and that's where you get your in-game money. But actually, in my case, I just followed all of these quests here, and I never had, I never really had any problems with in-game money. Um, just follow the quest because, for example, you finish the quest. You see that you get experience, you get Decena, which is the in-game money you need to buy in-game items like potions and stuff. And you get rewards, see? Training bag, this is very good. Um, these are one of the first things you have to buy because it increases your inventory space. So click it, and now you have two bags. So a maximum of five bags with five slots, so just do the math. <laughs> That's the maximum amount of things you can hold so press J again on your keyboard and there here are your next quests click it again and this time um, your monsters are here already in the sunny plane so go back to your HQ you're gonna need to teleport there using this magical portal in the middle of HQ okay and basically that's it just follow um, your basic quest in the journal so eventually you're gonna have to go to harem numerous citadel set desert and the rest of the maps and by the time you reach those maps you're gonna have um, you're gonna know the basics of the game already so um, I don't want to spoon feed you just download the game or just play the game and um, just play by yourself. It's a little boring in the beginning because um, uh, you don't have a lot of skills yet and 
your armors aren't cool but eventually the game picks up so it's very exciting especially when you're in the neutral area already where there's a lot of pvp happening so uh, i guess that's it um one last thing press c on your um keyboard and it opens up your character info and if you go to ability info melee here is your pt for close range weapons range um yeah you, people don't really pt this anymore um summon it's only for summoners the race specialty of Korra. force you might want to pt these but uh, i'll just save that for a different tutorial and shield and defense especially shield you should try to pt these like wear a shield as early as possible try to get hit and try to block the monsters trust me you're gonna need them in the end game so yes i guess that is it for this basic tutorial just check back in the video for more rf online videos in the future and i actually have a lot of rf tutorials already so just browse through the channel my name again is christian and if you guys like the video don't forget to drop a like comment down if you have any questions i'll try to answer them and as always don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you haven't subscribed yet please do subscribe so i will see you again next time in another rf online video hey, hey. peace out